as is tradition, winter project. I got some Mutazu hard bags. The key is different than the bike key, but that doesn't matter as far as I'm concerned. I don't know if that matters to people like you, dear viewer. They're less than half the price of the OEMs. They come with all sorts of mounting brackets and spacers and washers and grommets, every possible mount thing that you possibly need. However, they also come with this bar that's supposed to go around the outside of your fender, uh, which is ugly. Or in the case of the 1300, it actually doesn't fit because it'll interfere with the, uh, the drive belt. I have to call out the Mutazu eBay store. They lied to me. They specifically told me that the brace bar does get installed and it doesn't interfere. Images on eBay show that the bar is not over top of the rear uh, tail light like it is on the 1100. It just doesn't fit the bike, the bike that it's being sold for. Just be aware, eBay guy might try to pull a fast one. So what I've done is I've got OEM brackets that I'm going to mount to the bike and then I'm going to adapt the Mutazu aftermarket hard bags to the OEM brackets. I hope, because the brackets were almost as much as the bags. This is my chest freezer, but it's my only like place to work right now. The OEM brackets also came with everything you could possibly need, and everything's got a part number, and everything's individually wrapped. Like, each one of these screws, like, there are washers in an individual baggie. You couldn't just give me a wa- whatever. It's a Yamaha. If you spill oil while doing an oil change on your Yamaha motorcycle, there is a part number for the paper towel you need to wipe it up. But there's no instructions, so what I've got is like an online view on my phone and I'm slowly trying to piece part numbers together with their location on this thing based on, yeah, the Yamaha official part buyer thing. So this is a plate and it's just going into where the passenger footrest is because that's not going to fit normally. There's going to be some spacers in this kit of mine. So first problem, this looks like the spacer that I need, but there's a different part number, a 2CA, whatever. Maybe this is a new version of that part. Completely different number. We're going to try it anyway. I do not think that's the one. Even if I'm pushing against it, that one would never fit. So this needs to be longer, and the bolt certainly implies that it's longer. Huh. So of course that little gap's gonna go away if you put one extra spacer, and here's the spacer, the one I took off. I'm an idiot. Bloody hell, I need to stop drinking, or maybe drink more. This is definitely how it needs to be mounted on top of the little trim rail thing. I thought you took that off because I'm an idiot. Yeah. Starting to look like it's coming together. This is where the, what you've got is two grommets, a spacer and a washer. And this is what goes on this side of the mount. And this goes on the inside of the bag, but this bag is different. I don't think it'll quite fit the hole, but we're going to try. Mutazu, you Genius bastards, this is a perfect mount for the OEM hard bag mounts. So, everything fits perfectly to the OEM mounts. It's one of these in between two of these. Except this one, I had to use the aftermarket bolt instead of Allen key because the hole is deeper on that particular one. But the other one is the same story. Job done. Total time, including figuring things out and making mistakes, like an hour. I'm actually really happy with these bags. I'm, I'm not happy with the eBay guy, but the bags themselves are really good quality, especially with the price. They look almost exactly the same as the OEM bags. So, yeah. Does anyone want four mounting brackets I'm never going to use? 